Welcome to my garden at 49 New Square, Cambridge. This would have been the 15th year we've opened for people in Cambridge and thereabouts to come and have a look and to contribute to Red Balloon. Unfortunately, because of COVID-19, we are not in that position, but we hope to bring you some of the highlights of my garden via this little mini series that our communications and fundraising managers doing. Um, so let me take you round the garden a bit. Um, this year we've had the most fantastic peonies. These are the last of them and this of course is one of those beautiful frilly fluffy ones and this teams so well with this beautiful magenta geranium. This is what I now call my yellow garden. It's the lower garden. It, as you can see, it has a pond in it, which by the way, the children of Red Balloon built many, many years ago. They dug it out themselves. But along the wall, I've got Shropshire Lass and a number of yellow roses that I picked up from the local supermarket, to be absolutely honest, which just provide the sort of yellowy tinge that I love for this part of the garden. What I have been trying to do in the garden over the last few years is to get two plants to work together. And here I have, as you can see, a purple clematis with a Laura Ford yellow rose. And I think they just look spectacular together. This year, the pond has been cleaner than ever. I don't know whether I've had more time because I've been at home or because the weather has been very friendly, but we have the most enormous tadpoles. And in the evening, if I come out, it's full of newts just hanging in the water. The peonies have been good, the roses have been even more magnificent this year and they have really taken over the walls and the fences as you will see, they have climbed together, they are working perfectly to provide me with a lovely barrier to the outside um, of New Square. People try and look in but they're just that bit high and they can't. And of course down below in the herbaceous borders we've got roses and we've got the hollyhocks are about to come out and the, the poppies are about to come out. Geums are just over, um, but have a look and take it in yourself. So whilst you can't come and see this garden this year, in person it will be open next year and whilst we can't even serve you tea and coffee virtually there will be the homemade cakes and the tea and the coffee served next year by children and staff of Red Balloon so please because we are going through a particularly difficult time we would really value any donation you can give us to keep us helping recover severely bullet children <laughs>